everybody welcome back this is the candid camper we got tones i got it right this time we got tones over here tones tv from bad thought studio and uh, we're going to do another trailer reaction today on the candid campers trailer reactions we are going to do inception, inception. huge movie freaking awesome uh came out 2010 it's christopher nolan film which is just fantastic um a budget of 160 million dollars which is kind of kind of a big budget uh, for what it is, but it, it makes sense. Um, but it, it did monster monster money. It did $839 million in the box office, which is just crazy <laughs> amounts of money. Um, this thing had everybody under the sun in it. You had Leonardo DiCaprio, uh, Killian Murphy, Joseph Gordon-Levitt, Tom Hardy. I, I feel like I'm missing people. Am I missing somebody? Who else am Michael, I missing? Tom's? Michael Caine. Michael Caine. There's more. I feel like there's still more people we're missing in here. Uh, Elliot Page, like, like, there's it's just the, the cast is deep. This is a deep cast. Um, but yeah, what do you think? What do you think of the movie? Have you seen it? Um, seen it, loved it. One of my you know favorite movies. Um, it, it was just a the concept is a huge thing when it comes to movies, and mm -hmm. I mean, this this stands alone as one of the, just an incredible concept. Um, Lee, like you said before we started, I, he didn't win a fucking Emmy or anything for this shit. I find that yeah. fucking fascinating, bro. Fascinating. Yeah. Um, it's funny you say the budget was 100, 100 mil or 190 mil or whatever. 160. If, looking back at it, it should have been even more because of all these yeah. huge names that are huge now, but not in 2010. They weren't as big, you know, 14 years ago. Mm -hmm. Um, so it probably would have even been bigger if, if they, um, you know, if they had it, if they, the thing about these kind of movies, it, what intrigues me is you go back and look at a movie like Inception and you look now and you're like, yeah, these are huge actors now, but mm -hmm. they, back in 2010, Leonardo DiCaprio and like, you know, Michael Caine were the only like two huge movie stars in this movie. Killian Murphy had a, you know, he had a couple really good movies. Uh, what was it like Daisy? I think it was. Yeah. Um, he yep. did. Um, but you know, some of these old, like I love looking back at old casts and be like, bro, they killed this casting because look at everyone now. They're huge movie stars. Yep. So um, another another fun fact too. This won four Oscars. Um, had 159 wins and 220 nominations total over like different, um, you know, like over different types of like Academy Awards. Genres, the, yeah. Yeah, the Australian Cinematographer Society, like all that stuff. But the main one, the Academy Awards, um, they did they did pretty damn good. That's crazy. It looks like they had nine wins from the Academy Award. Um, Christopher Nolan got Best Motion Picture of the Year, and then also Best Writing Original Screenplay. Pretty damn, Grant, pretty he didn't damn win good. A, uh, Leonardo DiCaprio didn't win a Grammy or something like this year, right? Or something not a nothing, Grammy. Nothing. Um, that's nothing crazy, here. man. Mm, he was nominated for Best Actor, but he didn't win it. Insane. Yep. Awesome. So yeah, uh, once again, this is this is a fantastic movie. The whole concept behind this is is crazy, like literally crazy. Um, just going in and and trying to change someone's mind, but your past comes digging. Up, like, dude, come on. Where and where the hell am I? This is real. Is this fake, dude? Just yep. fantastic. Um, I've never seen this trailer. Obviously, I've seen the movie. So yeah, let's see if this uh, movie trailer holds up and see if it would have got us into the theater. All right. What's the most resilient parasite? An idea. A single idea from the human mind can build cities. An idea can transform the world and rewrite all the rules. Which is why... I have to steal it. Never recreate from your memory. Always imagine new places. A fresh is it? He's hiding something, and we need to find out what that is. We gotta break out of here. Give him the kick. Give 
This was not a part of the plan. Wake me up! Wake me up! Um, good, good trailer, not great trailer. It was pretty good. Um, yeah, I was expecting a little bit more. That was the original trailer, it's, it's so kind of, it's kind of short, huh? Yeah, it was only a minute and 24 seconds. Yeah, kind of a short um, trailer. It was, um, it was entertaining. Two, in, sorry, it, two minutes and fifth seconds. That was a fast two minutes. I think, uh, I liked it. I don't think it was the best trailer I've ever seen in my life. Um, but it was it was pretty action packed. It had a suspense to it, and it, it did it, it left me wanting more for sure. And it would have brought me to go see it because of that reason. So yeah. I would say it was a good trailer, um, but it was also lacking. I think they could have done another minute on that and, and gave us a little bit more. Yeah, this this movie was fantastic, bro. Like I don't know that like maybe the maybe it did was missing a little bit, but you know. If you know this movie, you know how good it is. Um, it, it for sure leaves you that you know the the world bending, it, it, the dude getting dumped in the water, like it leaves you with suspense. So it for sure will get me to go see it, this movie. It holds but up for my two end. for a two and a half hour movie. We could have got a longer trailer. Yeah, well, this was the original trailer, so the, the, yeah. there's there's probably more trailers that are longer. But this was yeah. the original like trailer. Yeah, for sure. Um, let me ask you this, Tones. Does it the trailer hold up for the time and then would have brought you into the theater? Yeah. Um it, it would have brought me in. And I'm a huge fan of Leonardo DiCaprio, one of one of the most iconic actors for me at least growing up. Um and any movie that he was in, you know, including this one, up until this one, it was fantastic. So Seeing him on the on the big screen was something I would love to see, but yeah, um, it definitely holds up in my opinion. Um, I actually want to go rewatch this movie. It's been years since I've watched it, so yeah, I, for sure, I might want to go watch it. Yeah, I, I'm gonna go rewatch it too. Um, such a classic, even though it's not that old. Um, yeah. Leonardo DiCaprio, like you said, he's just a fucking master of an art. Like he's he's an artist for sure. He can do it all. Uh, there's so many countless movies where you're just like dude how how do you transform yourself into that person just amazing um so just once again nailed it christopher nolan is a genius too great great um good, great job on this yeah it holds up for me it would have brought me into the theater for sure um i'm gonna go rewatch this probably tonight that's how good it was yeah. <laughs> so awesome y'all uh yeah tones you want to tell them where they can find you yeah, guys, find me at Tones underscore TV on all platforms. Follow the podcast with Candid and I, Bad Thoughts Podcast. Mm -hmm. And follow my YouTube channel, Bad Thoughts Studios, where we do movie trailer reviews, um, trailer reactions, breakdowns for uh, specific TV shows and movies. Uh, Bad Thoughts Studios on YouTube for that one. Sweet. Yeah, and you can find me at Candid Camper right here on my YouTube channel. Like and subscribe. And if you want to do a trailer with us, just let us know. And if you want us to do a trailer reaction to one of your favorite trailers, let us know our favorite movies. Just let us know down in the comments below. Or you can DM me over at the Candid Camper with an extra R at the end on IG. You can also find me over um, on the Bad Thoughts podcast with your boy Tones. And, uh, yeah, let's get it. I appreciate you all out there. Like and subscribe. Comment below. Peace.